Every week, a million more people live in a city than they did the week before. And this is going to continue for the next 30 years. So by 2050, two thirds of the nine billion people on the planet will live in a city. And this means living with each other is going to get even more tricky. Bristol is open as an R&D digital test bed used by Bristol and our partners to develop and test the programmable city of the future. Uh, Bristol is open is using software-defined networking to interconnect a very extensive communication infrastructure, and that includes fiber in the ground, a lot of fiber in the ground, it includes a full mile of 5G, wireless connectivity, and the full canopy of Internet of Things extending and covering the whole city. So what we do with this infrastructure, we dynamic slice it, so we offer the right environment for different applications to experiment with. This kind of elastic connectivity can scale, can scale to thousands of users, thousands of experimenters, thousands of applications, and this is exactly what we feel future cities need. Bristol is a very fast-growing city. We're a city region of a million people. That brings real opportunities, but also challenges that need to be addressed. How do we keep the cars flowing around the city? How do we manage air quality? How do we care for a growing older population and public safety? All of these things are big issues for us, and we believe that Bristol is open and data are part of the solution. As we invest in a new city operations centre, as we invest in retrofitting the planetarium to enable us to visualise data in 3D in real time, as we plan for a new 12,000-seater arena in the city, we know that data and information is absolutely key to the future-proofing of those infrastructure assets within Bristol. But most importantly in Bristol, it is about citizens and about the community. It's about responding to the ideas that are generated there. The next digital revolution will connect people, places and things. It's about programmable cities and that's why Bristol is open.